right so what is self introduction and how to do self introduction so before moving to today's class um there are two activities that i want to conduct today the first one is i want uh, you to self introduce yourself okay just a short introduction you can take just uh, one minute not more than that okay In, within one minute you have to introduce yourself okay so i will be calling out your names after that there is one more activity that's a suspense only after that we will be moving to the grammar class is it fine yes ma'am yes, yes ma'am yes ma'am right. yeah i want a thumbs up i want a thumbs up from all your side from all your side i want a thumbs up you can just uh, give one reaction you know how to react in google meet right ah kiran has given amla jyoti jaya yeah jaya i have to add your name yeah okay jaya bulo okay there there one okay, boy fine. So, sriniti also is there sriniti one boy yes sir already added yeah i have added sriniti raman uh. okay kavinaya in give a comment box okay fine fine good okay so now i will start with the self introduction of aradhana you can just introduce yourself in one minute okay okay ma'am okay fine go on good morning to all my name is aradhana i am studying in class of 5th b my father's name is sendil kumar my mother's name is nitya my father's occupation is welder my mother's occupation is homemaker my sister's name is asmita she is studying in class of 10th a my hobby is singing my ambition is singer okay good good i think uh, you did well aradhana but you can reduce the speed okay like you completed in some 20 seconds i think okay so that you can take uh, till 1 minute okay we are giving you 60 seconds so you can um, slowly introduce yourself no need to hurry up okay so tell 1 minute only so that's why i'm just speedily ah, yeah so you feared okay okay uh, okay so whether i will cross the limit you was you were fearing right okay i understood why why like that okay kavinaya could you please mute yourself seven so yeah okay okay aradhana it was a good introduction thank you so next is amala jyoti is come on guys be free okay you are go just going to tell about yourself nothing more than that okay so you are you should be you should be proud to introduce yourself yes amala good morning good morning all i am amala jyoti yeah. i am pursuing my second year uh, in be computer science okay and uh, i am from a nuclear family Okay. My father is a private employee. My sister mm. is studying eleven standard. My mm. mom is a housewife. Okay. My hobbies are singing, drawing, watching TV. Hmm. That's okay, all. Thank fine. you. Okay. Then. Okay. Good. Okay. So, what's your ambition? May I know your goal? Um. Uh, I have to be placed in IT company, ma'am. Okay, so you want to become an IT, um, what to say, um, <laughs> um, software engineer? Yeah, software engineer. Good, good. Okay, so best wishes, Amala. Okay, Thank fine. You, you are welcome. And next is Ananti. Ananti, can you introduce today? In the last class, you were not that much confident, but can you introduce today? It's very um, easy. Right? Yes, Ananti, you can do. Mm. Mama, uh, I'm not studying, mom, but housewife. Uh, I. <laughs> okay, okay. You can just tell what you are doing. Okay, you are housewife. You can tell about your family, no issues. Okay, you can tell where you studied. You completed MA, right? Yes, mom. Ah, then you can tell where you studied. Uh, graduate. Where did you complete your graduation, or um, how was your um, MA? You can tell everything like that. okay no issues even now i am see i am not a student i am actually working as a teacher but i can share my experiences about my graduation right yes ma'am yeah so can you give a try for just one minute ah uh, okay ma'am yeah good morning i am anandip from uh, chrome pet uh, okay 
I'm 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 from a nuclear family. Hi. But mom, uh, hmm. I married mom. Um, one baby and my okay. husband. Okay, very good. Okay, well, how old is your baby? Um, uh, four years, mom. Four years. Okay. So, is that is that a boy or a girl? Girl baby, mom. Girl baby. Okay. What's her name? Yam Prakati. Okay, her name is Pragadi. Okay, okay, fine. Anyways, uh, thank you, Ananti. So you can also learn how to introduce yourself because uh, uh, you being a housewife, uh, your introduction will be slightly different. Okay, that's not an issue. After this class, I will just post a sample in the group. Okay, so from okay. that you can understand how to do that. Okay, fine. Okay, so good attempt. Yeah, and yeah, the next man. is um, Kathiravan. Kathiravan, or who is there in the meet now? Kavirasan, yeah. Kavirasan? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, you can do your self introduction. Um, okay. I am Kavirasan. I am studying 12th standard in Government High Secondary School, Saukat Palayam. My father's mm -hmm. name is Harul Silvan, and he is a mm -hmm. civil engineer. My mother's name mm -hmm. is Maliga. He is a uh, government school headmaster. Oh, good. My, uh. my hobby is riding cycle. Hmm. My my ambition is become an IAS officer. Very good. Very good. Very good, Arun Selvan. Thank you. Sorry, sorry. Uh, Kavi Arasan. Okay, there is Kathiravan there? Yeah. No, yes, ma'am. Kathiravan. Self introduction. Yes, Kathiravan can also introduce. Self introduction is sweet. Hmm? Hi, Kadiravan. You can introduce yourself. Yes, ma'am. Hmm. I am Kadiravan. Hmm. I'm studying 10th year. Hmm. Hmm. My father's name is Harul Chilvan. Okay. My mother's name is Maliga. Hmm. My father's occupation is civil engineer. Okay. My mother's occupation is teacher. Mother's occupation and father's occupation. Okay. Mm. You have to add that S. Mm. Okay. Uh. My hobby is playing mm. football. Mm. My aim is IAS. Mm. Okay. So two IAS officers from one family. Okay, guys. India is waiting for you. Okay. Very good. Okay. Next, Jenny. Yes, it's your turn, Jenny. Yeah. Jenny Jaswin. Ma'am, my name is Jennifer. I'm studying 9th. My, my father's occupation is cooking master. My mother's occupation is tailoring. And my ambition is a lawyer. My hobby is drawing and dancing. Yes, very good, Jenny. OK. So, I think next can be given to uh, Jaya. Jaya Bilo, are you there in the meet? Yes, ma'am. Yes, Jaya. My name is Magdalena Mary. I am from Dindukar. Mm. Mm. My father's name is Arul Das. My mother's name is Jay Bula. I have one sister. Her name is Danika. She is studying fourth standard. My hobby is reading books. I want to become an IAS officer. Okay. So can you just tell your name? What, uh, what is it? Margaret? Magdalena Mary. Magdalena Mary. Okay. okay Magdalena fine. Mary. Magdalena Mary. Okay. Fine. Mm -hmm. Good. May I will call you Mary. Okay. Okay. Mary. Good. So next is um, Carlin Kavita. Who is that? Carlin Kavita. Carlin uh, Kavita, are you there in the meet? Okay, so next is Kavi Kavi. Who is that? Mommy, ma'am. Oh, yeah, your name? 
Kavistri, ma'am. Kavistri, okay, Kavistri, you can go ahead. Yeah. Okay. Good morning to all. I am Kavistri. I am studying a class in Government Higher Secondary School, Parayur. I am from I am I am from nuclear family. My uh, my father's name is Dinesh Kumar. My mother's name is Sri Vidya. My father mm -hmm. is a driver. My mother's mother is a housewife. Mother, is he, mother uh, Kavi, uh, Kavi Sri, one small correction. Uh, when you are telling my father is, uh, uh, for example, my father is a driver or my father is a teacher, then you no need to add that S. Okay, my father's is no need to tell. When you are telling my father's occupation, so you have to use that S. Okay, my father's occupation, my mother's okay. occupation, like that. Okay, if you are not telling that using that word occupation, then you can just tell my father is um, a driver or my mother is a teacher, like that. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Yeah. My mother is a housewife. Okay. My hobby is drawing and craft making. My ambi my I have two ambition. First one is lawyer, and next one is um, best computer hacker. Thank you. Okay. What is the second one? <laughs> I couldn't understand. What is the second one? Um, computer hacker. Computer hacker for okay, okay, fine. So you want to hack? Uh, wow. Okay. <laughs> Okay, it's a, it's a new ambition. Okay, I haven't heard this ambition from anyone. Very good. So you will be a jinn. You will be a boom in uh, the world of software. Okay, you will create some booms. Okay, very good. Next is uh, Kiran. Kiran Subramanian, can you introduce yourself? I think uh, Kiran, you are attending for the first time, but you know how to introduce, right? It's very simple. Yes, ma'am, I know. Good morning, everyone. My name is Kiran. I am studying in 8th class. Uh, I am studying in Sam Modrian's Higher Secondary School, Thali. Okay. Uh, I am living near Thali mm. Temple. Mm. My mother's name is Meenakshi and my father's name is Subramanian. My, mm. uh, my fa father works uh, in uh, petrol pump and my mother is housewife. Okay. Uh, my um, my hobby is to make paper crafts and my mm. ambition is to become a uh, Indian Army officer. Indian Army officer, very good. Okay, yes, so yes. you are uh, aiming for Army. Okay, good, good. Very good, Kiran. Yeah. It was a good self-introduction. Yes, next is Prema. Yes, ma'am. Good morning to yes. all. Mm. Good morning to all. My name is M. Prema. I am studying 8th standard in high... In government school, I'm coming from Natham. My father's name is B. Marimuthu. My mother's name is M. Jaya Bhagyam. My father, mm. my father is, my father's occupation is um, bus body, bus working, bus bodyguard. My mother's, my mother is homemaker. I have one sister. Mm. My sister's name is M. D. because she is studying in third standard. My hobby is drawing and writing and reading. My goal is I'm I'm in my I'm my I'm in my class. I'm a first mark. My mm. ambition is English teacher. Very good, very good, good, good. Okay. So you love English? You like English? Huh? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So um, why do you like English? I want to know the reason also. <laughs> ma'am, in Mom, in uh, my first hand, uh, my in my first hand, uh, I was like English, mom. It was easy subject, ma'am. Okay, in the first standard, I now you should not tell I was like English. I liked English. Okay. Okay, ma'am. I liked English and still you like English. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Very good. Okay. So that was a good introduction. Okay. So I think one new person has joined, right? Ananda Krishnan. Hi, Ananda Krishnan. Uh, hi, good morning. Yeah. Hello, good morning. So now currently yeah. we are doing self introduction. In the previous class, uh, we uh, uh, I taught the, the students to do self introduction. Okay, in a very simple way. So I will call out your name in the last because you can just see how others are um, introducing themselves. Okay. So according okay, okay. to that, you can also introduce yourself. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Fine. yeah. Next is um, Srinisha. Yes. Yes. 
Yes, Sri Nisha, you can do your introduction. Good morning to all. I am Sri Nisha. Mm -hmm. My father's name is Sri Ram. He is uh, shipyard supervisor at Singapore. Mm -hmm. <coughs> My mother's name is Gayatri. She is mm -hmm. housewife. Mm -hmm. I am studying 8th standard at Natham. Mm -hmm. Uh, G GHS Natham. Mm. I'm from nucleus family. My hobby mm. is painting. My ambition is an um, IAS officer. Mm. And also I'm an athlete player. Athlete player. Okay, very good. Good, good, fine. So um, one small suggestion for Srinisha that uh, first you said your name. But after that, immediately you told my father's name and your mother's name, right? So instead of that, you have to tell your uh, school, uh, your class, and your school, and then your uh, hobbies or anything, and then you can tell you about your family. Okay. Okay. Yeah. By while introducing, firstly, we want to know everything about you, about that particular person. We want to know if it is Nisha, then we want to know uh, the important points about Nisha first. Only then we want uh, the other details. Uh, um, we in the sense um, the teachers or the people who you meet outside okay yeah and also the word uh, it is nuclear okay so i think someone uh, told it as nucleus i heard it a uh, nucleus it's not nucleus it is nuclear okay nucleus is actually the center of the cell that comes in biology okay nuclear is the small it means small so i am from a nuclear family you should not tell it's nucleus Okay, okay ma'am. Yeah, very good, Nisha. So next, um, sorry, Viveka can tell ma'am. Yes, I will call you. I will call. I am calling according to the alphabetical order. Okay. So next comes uh, Pranav. Pranav. Pranav, are you there in the meet? Okay, so next is uh, Radhimala. Ma'am. Yes, Radhimala, you can introduce yourself. Good morning. First, good morning to all. First of all, thank you for giving some chance for intro myself. I'm Prakshna. I'm studying 8th standard. In my school, GRM, I'm, I'm from Tiruvaru. My father name is Vail Murugan. My mother name is Radhimala. My mm. father occupation is Singapore. Singapore in work and my mother is housewife. My hobby is drawing and writing and reading and speak something. Speech. Mm. Mm. And my occupation. And, uh, and I'm and I want to tell something with my mm. ambition is IAS. Okay, okay, okay fine. So Ratimala, you uh, the introduction was good, but there were some mistakes. Like um, you um, after the first part, that is, you said I'm studying in uh, the school, the place. You said okay. In which in which class are you studying? Eight, ma'am. Eighth Eight standard. standard. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Fine. So uh, you can just um, try it in a little more better way. Okay. So while telling my father's occupation is, uh, you have to tell the job. Okay. Instead of telling the place. Where he is working, you you told he is working in Singapore. You said okay, but we want to know the job, job nature. Okay, like teacher or um, whatever it may be, teacher or painter or uh, driver, salesman, whatever job it may be. Okay, so you have to tell the name of that occupation. Okay, so good. So next is uh, Kavineya. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. I am Kavinaya. I am from mm. Ranipet. I am mm. studying in class 8 in Vedavali Vidyalaya Ranipet. Mm. I have a sister. She is studying in class 4. Mm. I am from nuclear family. My mm. father's occupation is farmer. My mm. mother is a homemaker. Mm. My hobbies are learning, singing and drawing. My mm. ambition is doctor. Very good. See, my ambition is to become a doctor. Okay. My ambition is to become a doctor. Exactly. Yes. Okay. So now Viveka, can you can do the introduction, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Mm. I am Viveka. I am from Ranipet. Mm. I am studying class 4th in Vedavili mm. Vidyalaya. 
I mm. have a sister. She is studying eight mm. in class eight. I am mm. from nuclear not, family. My father, mm. my father, okay. my father's occupation is farmer. My mother is home maker. My okay. hobby is my hobbies are reading, listening, singing, mm. drawing, and. Okay. Paper making. Okay, good. Is IAS officer. IAS officer. Okay, very good. Okay, fine. So very good, Viveka. Next, Sriniti, you can do the introduction. Ma'am, I am Sriniti. I am studying twelfth standard. My father mm -hmm. name is Raman. My mother name is Deepa. I have mm -hmm. one sister. She is studying tenth standard. Mm. Uh, my hobby is uh, playing mm. volleyball. Mm. Uh, my ambition is become a great IAS officer. Good, good, good. Okay, yeah. Now, um, is Srinisha there in the sorry? Uh, Sriniti Raman. It's actually Sriniti. Um, may I know your name? It's Sriniti, or is that uh, her brother? Okay, next, Anantha Krishnan, you can can you do your self intro? Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, okay. Hi, good morning, all. My name is Anantha Krishnan. I am from Kerala, Calicut, and I am now working in Cello Pens India Private Limited as a executive. Uh, my main hobby is watching movies and play, uh, playing cricket. And uh, I have I stay with my mother and uh, my father. I'm single. Okay. Hello. Okay, fine. Okay, so now I think you all would have got an idea about doing your self introduction. Okay, so you can practice it often, and you can just um, make it a habit. Like uh, when you meet your friends and all, you can just introduce yourself. Okay, so is anyone having any doubts with that self-introduction part? No, ma'am. No, no ma'am. No. no. Okay, so you are clear with that. Okay, ma'am. Hello, hello, ma'am. Moving to the second activity that we have to complete it a little faster. Okay, so that is the picture activity. As you all know. What is the speciality of today? Friendship. Day. Yes, it's friendship day. Yeah. Yes. Can so can you see my uh, screen? Is my screen visible? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. okay. So again, I'm giving you a speaking activity for just one minute. Okay. So you have to tell something about friendship day. Okay. Or about your best friend. and why you like your friend like that you can just give a speech for 1 minute so i will call out the names in the same order okay so the first person will be amala jyoti yeah good morning everyone mm. and uh, today is friendship day uh, happy friendship day yeah thank you ma'am you can wish your friends yeah mm. uh, friendship is most important uh, thing as a student Mm. Because uh, if we have friends, we, we will be able to share our uh, feelings, mm. share our food, and uh, enjoy a lot. Mm. Uh, I have many friends in my class. Mm. Uh, particularly, I have three best friends, and uh, we enjoy a lot every day in our college. Mm -mm. I have got uh, very good friends. Thank you. Very good. That's nice to know. Okay, so next, can I call Ananta Krishnan? Will you be able to speak about that? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Hi. Good morning, all, and happy Friendship Day to all. Today is the day, International Friendship Day. <clears throat> uh, as per we know, we all have so many friends in our life. We day by day, so we meeting so many people. Uh, somewhere, just we know. That's all. Some some people we um, mingle with them. too friendly and someone from my family or someone from um 
bus or someone from classes someone someone from working places so many people we are meeting all they are we put the list then uh, put the name a uh, list on friends but they are only few people can understand us and understand what is our um, what the said mental connection or something they very so closely with us we can share with them all our life in, 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 um, our life in, in Hmm. Yeah, you. I were uh, almost. You are coming to the point. Yeah. yeah. Incidents or something. Hmm. They are so um, very special to us. That some hmm. girlfriends have, so some boyfriends or some other. Hmm. They are very precious to us. Keep friendships with all our all peoples and true to all friends. That's all. Yes, very good, Ananta Krishnan. You shared a very valuable message, and um, it is actually friendship doesn't uh, it it couldn't be made with everyone who um, whoever we meet they won't become our friends. Friends are something uh, people who are very special, and uh, it's like you have you share a uh, it's a relationship. Yeah, it's an eternal relationship. Like uh, we people believe that only a relationship means it's between a husband and a wife or between a a couple. Okay, but that's not the fact. It's actually friendship is something which is very eternal. Okay, so every relationship has a value: a mother and a child, a father and a child. Likewise, friends. Friendship is also at such a great tie up. Okay, very good. Yeah. Next, Anandhi. Yeah, thank you, uh, Anandhi Krishnan. Anandhi. Thank you. Mom, I'm not prepared, Mom, but uh, I Google oh. search. Uh, uh, oh, you want? You can just tell about your friend's name and why you like or him or her like that. Mm. Oh, okay, Mom. Mm. Happy Friendship Day to all. Uh, mm. uh, um. <laughs> yeah, Mom, Mom, Mom. <laughs> okay, Mom, you get, okay. I will call out you. I will call you out in the last. Okay. No worries. Okay, no need to prepare. Give a small suggestion for you. What you okay. can do at home, you can speak with your child for for uh, fourth standard, no? No, sir. Oh, four year four old. Okay, okay, four year old is too too young. I mean, after one or two years, you can speak with your son, son or daughter, in English. And uh, and once he goes to the school, he will come back and talk in English, and you will also improve. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. This is the, this is the easiest method for you. Okay, sir. Okay, thank you. I'm thank going you. to grammar class. Yeah, yeah. Uh, thank you, Anupurni. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's a good suggestion, sir. It it was actually in there fact, in uh, the first class. Yeah. Yes. Uh, in fact, when 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 I about fifteenth, nineteen ninety seven. That means uh, how much? Twenty oh. three years back, we gave first uh, spoken English class for a company. Uh, in a company mm -hmm. for engineers, all our engineers. They were good in English, okay. but they cannot. They are not willing to speak in English. And we said, mm -hmm. you, you find a partner for you. And many people yeah. they made their uh, uh, their uh, uh, child as a partner. Mm -hmm. And uh, they whatever they talk with the child, they have to come and repeat it in the class the next day. And we had uh, yeah. so like that. We mm -hmm. it was very successful. In fact, I got that letter even today. Uh, they have given mm -hmm. uh, all our people have started speaking English like that. They have given a appreciation letter, and it was taken only 14 one hour class. Only 14 okay, okay, class. So It's supposed to okay. take 15, but uh, by 14 class they all started speaking English. So that's a very powerful method, Madam Anandi, Madam. That is the best method. You try. Uh, Yes, the reason is because we don't need to fear our children. Yeah. We do. We can sp speak freely to with our children. No need to fear because uh, they are not going to scold you or uh, uh, comment on you. Okay, they can't find any fault on us. So whatever what they do is, ah, okay, Amma is speaking English. That's what they will tell and they will motivate you more. They will just encourage you. Ah, Amma, Amma, Amma is speaking in English. Ah, okay, then I also want to learn English. that will be the curiosity in the child's mind so naturally she will also speak and by the side on the other hand you will also learn how to speak okay that's the reason uh, keshav muti sir is suggesting this method okay ananthi so okay, no worries okay. about that okay fine yeah next uh, um, kaviyarisen yes we will make it fast guys by 11 o'clock we have to complete this uh, friendship day topic okay kaviyarisen ma'am i didn't ready ma'am you i am not ready okay um kadiravan i am here sir not ready ma'am 
please or hey you just have to tell about your friend and you are not ready huh watch this man yeah who has raised the hand prema is yes, prema you can do it yes ma'am mm. we will make happy, it fast yeah mm. okay, happy friendship day ma'am i will tell about one poem ma'am friend friends poem ma'am yeah you can recite it quickly yeah mm. every garden must have a rose every mm. grass must have a dew and every person in the world must have a friend like you happy friendship day wow very good so there is one poet in our group very good very good prema please send that poem in the whatsapp group okay i really wanted to uh, share it with my friends okay, okay. i didn't get, i didn't get time this year to write any poem or any uh, letter to my friends so please okay. do share it in the poem sorry in the group sorry <laughs> okay fine very good next is uh, jenny a uh, jenny guys i will call you in order because uh, it's a little bit confusing for me okay that's why i'm not um, calling the names who are raising the hands okay i'm having an order here that's why i'm going according to that jenny are you ready Okay, Jaya. She is leaving the meet, ma'am. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, okay, so she has left the meet. Okay. Is Jaya? You can do. Ah. Uh. My bestie's name is Jaya Viola. She is my mother. Ah. Uh, okay. I want to tell something. Hmm. Dear bestie, mm. no matter how many friends I have, no matter how much I talk to them or spend time with them. Mm. Always remember that mm. no one can replace you. You mm. were, are, and, uh, and will always be irreplaceable. Mm. You have a special place in my heart forever. That's great. That's great, uh, Magdalena. You are Magdalena, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just repeating the names to confirm. Okay. So very good. That's nice. Happy friendship day to your mom. Okay. Next, um, Kavi, Kavi. I uh, good morning to all. A uh, happy friendship day to to all. I have more best friends, but I have but I like one best friend. Her, her name is Jovita. Jovita is my classmate. She she is my wonderful friend for me. Um, she is a wonderful friend of mine. Okay. Uh. And why you like her? because she is a wiggly type wiggly okay wiggly what is the what is wiggly <laughs> mom innocent innocent okay she is very innocent okay is that the karnin kavita uh, jovita are both same yes ma'am ah okay 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 fine uh. and that that's all ma'am very good okay next kiran first i wish you all a happy friendship day Okay. I have a lot of friends. Ah, mm. uh, I have a lot of friends in my school. Uh, Navan, Dian, Arjun, Sai, Hirnando. They mm. all are my classmates. Mm. I like. Uh, I like to enjoy with my friends. Mm. Uh, uh, and sharing food and others, food mm. to others. Mm. Uh, and uh, uh, and I uh, and I have a uh, place to uh. Mm. place to uh, the uh, a place in my heart to uh, in, in my friends okay that, um that's all miss that's it okay fine that's good so next is um, munia sami m actually i don't know your name munia sami ma'am yeah what's your name my name is jamuna ma'am Jamuna okay so can you just tell about your friend okay ma'am good morning to all my name is jamuna friendship vachi na solla pare happy friendship day friendship is the best friend friend beautiful friend friendship is the best best friend beautiful friendship friendship okay. Thank you ma'am. 
ओके ओके फ्रेंड नेक्स्ट श्रीनिशा हाय मैम वन सेकेंड हैप्पी फ्रेंडशिप डे टू ऑल आई हैव अ लॉट ऑफ फ्रेंड्स इन माय क्लास बट वन ऑफ माय बेस्ट फ्रेंड इज दिव्या जोधी शी इज वन ऑफ पर्सन हु लव मी अ लॉट एंड ट्रूथ इन ए शॉर्ट अबाउट हर द बॉन्ड आई शेयर विथ माय बेस्ट फ्रेंड इज वन ऑफ माय मोस्ट प्राइज्ड पोजीशन बोथ ऑफ एस Mm. We push each others to do our best. Mm. Uh, and my best friend is very uh, soft person. Mm. Your best friend is indeed a pressure gem. Mm. And my fortunate to have found that gem of my life. Okay, very good, Sinisha. Good. So next is Aradhana. Ma'am. Hmm. Hi Aradhana you can tell you can speak about your friend or friendship day Happy friendship day to all I mm. have one friend in my class her name is Eva Evelina she is mm. the one of my best to friend she mm. was very in in the sense and mm. she will, I will cry I have a headache I have any mm. pain means I will cry mm Okay, in school itself, she will mm-hmm. only okay. I will say, tell the mom you sleep like that. She will told. Like <laughs> hmm. Okay. Okay. Like so, her. so you like your friend because she puts you to sleep. Okay. <laughs> and then okay. I will do any work to my friends. She will not talk with me. Hmm. Not talk with me. Hmm. I will go and ask sorry, and she will not talk with me. One day, mm-hmm. fully, she will not talk with me. And uh-huh. next day, come and give me sorry, girl, like that. Told them she itself will talk. Okay, ah, uh, if you become the class leader and if you write her name, then how will she talk, Aradhana? Ah, uh, mm-hmm. if you write, no, no, I will. <laughs> she talk in English. I will not. I will write her. Okay. Sir, friend, I can not write his name. Means I am not doing my duty wrong. Yes, 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 yes. I was just kidding. Okay, I just I was just joking. Good, Aradhana. Is Prema my best friend? Is Yoga Bharati very good? Be or uh, in your be in friendship. Okay, and uh, let it be a good friendship forever. Next is Pranav. Pranav, sir, are you there in the meet? Pranav, no, Pranav is not. Ah, yes, because he is calling the number. Can can you hear me, man? Yes, I can hear you. Yes, ma'am. But I can, but I am hearing something else in Tamil. Okay. Then now, man. Ah, now it's fine. Okay. Today, good morning to all. Today, I am going to speak about friendship. Today is friendship day. friends are very important in our life mm. we share all our feelings mm. with our friends they give us they give us some mm, mm. they give us some calm warmth mm. yes, comfort then we enjoy with our friends without mm. friends we we without friends yeah we don't have more happiness yeah friends are, are always their friends mm. without friends, friends are, yeah very good. yes yes yeah friends tell us some solutions to mm. our problems in life thank very you very good very good very good without friends life is meaningless that's what pranav is actually trying to tell very good pranav next is um, Kavinaya Yes ma'am Good morning one and all present here mm. Happy friendship day to all mm. Today is a special day that is a friendship day okay This friendship I would do not think Living without a friend is a truly difficult uh, mm. a true friend will be um, Instructing us uh, to not uh, do not go to bad uh, mm. bad ways. Uh, they will be correct uh, correcting us from uh, bad ways. Mm. 
my best friend is my mother she will be um, correcting hmm. me uh, to not go from to not um, go for bad ways hmm and my another uh, best and naughty friend is my sister ah okay okay <laughs> and uh, we both will fight together it is a uh, enjoyable moment okay that's all ma'am that's fine okay now next is viveka yes ma'am hmm happy friendship day yeah Happy Friendship Day! Thank you. Mm. To all, mm. my best friend is my mother, mm. and my best friend is no naughty and uh, notorious friend is my sister, ma'am. Okay. Mm. In my best friend is in my classes. Mm. Shruti Kumari. Hmm. She is the not Hindu. She is. She is. She will talk in English. Hmm. And Hindi. Hmm. With me. So that it is very useful to speak Hindi and English, ma'am. Okay. So you also learn Hindi. Hmm. Yes, ma'am. Okay. And she also a very helpful for me. Hmm. I, and I am also a helpful for her. Okay. When I am doing some, she also help me, help me. Hmm. When I am, I am getting some prizes, mm -hmm. she, she will be happy. and uh, she will tell to others okay good very good uh, viveka fine thank you ma'am good okay thank you so the last call is for sriniti raman sriniti raman ma'am did not prepare ma'am okay i may know your name i'm sriniti Srinidhi Raman. Okay, okay, fine. So next is uh, Rati Malar. Did I call you? No, ma'am. Ah, yes. Uh, so the last one will be Rati Malar. Okay, Rati Malar. Yeah. Good morning to all. First mm. of all, thank you for give some chance for intro my friends. Friendship. Give some chance. Okay. Thanks. Thank you for giving me some chance. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Mm. friendship is very important relationship in our life we can share everything with our friends friends bringing happy happiness in our life good friends guide us to do good things a person without a friends life is hard life i tell some poem ma'am yeah you can recite it quickly okay okay ma'am best friends stick together till us end they are like a straight line that will not bend the smiles between us cannot keep us apart because we will keep each another closer at heart poet i'm uh, until i'm want to tell some poetry ma'am Yeah um okay so you can just tell it no issues so is it so long No ma'am enough ma'am Okay our heart okay. beats no our heart beats our hope heart beats stop but our friendship is cannot stop end how end Thank you ma'am Good good it's good to write poems okay very good so i think i have called all your names okay i have called out uh, nearly 19 people okay so fine guys so that was a good um uh, talk it was a good speech to know about your friends yeah anand is yet yeah, okay okay is anand you can complete it uh. uh happy friendship day to all i may uh, i may have lots of friends but i so much like uh, one my best friend her name is deepika any mm -hmm. important problems uh 
in my life discussing in my friend uh, mm. correct solution and said my friend so so much like my friend deepika so much important uh, my life that's all ma okay very good very good it's short but simple okay i like my friend very much very good okay thank you ananthi good some people they won't even come forward they will just uh, skip okay uh, okay uh, fine ma'am didn't call my name so they will try to escape but you came forward in spite uh, of uh, not calling your name okay very good ananthi you have to come forward like this that's what we all want thank you ma'am yeah okay so today uh, just uh, give me a moment guys um we will be moving to the new topic that is articles okay actually articles i thought i can complete in this class but no issues we will just begin the topic okay we can begin the topic and uh, we will continue the topic in the next class also that's not an issue we can just see the first half today okay so before moving to the topic before uh, sharing my screen how many of you are aware of the topic articles okay then only one person okay okay can anyone tell uh, what is an article or what are articles hmm. yes um yeah and the a and and d okay these are called articles fine okay so what else do you know about articles there are two types of articles definite and indefinite articles a and r definite article indefinite articles d is definite articles mm d is the definite article yes so a and r and are called the indefinite and d is the definite okay so then anything else ma'am who raised their hands actually yeah yes aradhana mm. and is come before the consonants and uh, a uh, who, who yes. raised the hand aradhana va yes ma'am ma'am yes you can continue mm. Yes, yes, you can continue. Come, yeah. Yes, has come before the consonant, and an has come before before the con vowels, and b has come before the special special thing. Special. Special. Special thing. Anything. B comes before special. Animals. Ah, uh, elephant like that. Okay, okay, fine. Yes, ah, uh, yes. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Okay, okay. Yes, uh, Nisha, Sri Nisha. Mom, can I say? Hmm. Yes, yes, ma'am. You can. Ma yeah. Yeah, is using to ah uh, consonants, ma'am. And is using to ah uh, before our uh, vowels. That is a e i o u. Hmm. there will be come any animals mm. or etc that's all mama ma article is a word that identify a noun as being specific or unspecific okay yes uh, is my screen visible guys mm. yes ma Yes, yes ma'am. Ma yes, yes. Okay, you can find it, right? Okay, okay. So articles are generally, it's the shortest topic in English grammar. Okay, articles are the small or shortest topic. The reason is, I said, as I already said, I thought we can cover it in just fifty uh, minutes or something. But today we had a lot to speak. One was about uh, the self introduction. and uh, about friendship day okay because if i skip the self introduction topic today then you will forget it if i uh, initially i thought of giving it in the next class but um, it will take so much time for you to recollect all that you have studied that's the reason i thought of again revising it in today's class also and uh, friendship day accidentally it's friendship day today that's why i came to know a lot about your friends and uh, your relationship with your uh, best friends okay So no issues. So we will just cover half of the 
portion today. Okay, so what is an article? An article is a short word that comes before a subject in a sentence. Okay, and most of the sentences we read and write have at least one article. Okay, so in our daily life, we read or we write so many sentences and at least there will be one article in a sentence. Every sentence will minimum have one article. For example, if I tell um, there is a beach near my house, there is a beach near my house. If I tell like that, then a beach, A is an article. Okay, but there are also sentences without articles. Very simple example is, my name is Annapurni. Is there any article in that sentence? No, ma'am. Yeah, so there are sentences which have an article and also which do not have an article. Okay, it, it is not compulsory that every sentence should have an article. It's not compulsory like that. But at least if in sentences that have articles or in a paragraph, in a long paragraph, say four to five, in a five to six sentences is there in a paragraph, at least there will be uh, uh, three or four articles in the sentences. Okay, in, in total, okay, in that complete paragraph, you can find at least three to four mm -hmm. articles. Now, there are totally three articles, as you are all aware of. The three articles are A, AN, and D. Okay. And again, we are classifying this into two. We are actually categorizing this into two. A, is called, A and AN are called the indefinite articles. Indefinite. Indefinite means something which is not definite, which is not clear. Okay. A and AN are called indefinite articles. And D is the definite article. So, there are totally three articles in English. So, what are the three articles? A, A and D. The, 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 A, A and, and D. These are the three articles in English. But we are classifying it into two indefinite articles and a definite article. So, indefinite articles, we are, we, are, we are telling it articles because there are two indefinite articles. But definite, there is only one. That is why we are calling definite article. That is only one definite article, that is the. Okay. So, this flowchart will be easy for you. Okay. Can you understand from this? Yes, those yeah. Not, yeah. Those who don't know articles, you can just look at this picture. It will be easy for you to understand. Okay, can I change the slide? Yes, ma'am. Oh, okay. So now we are going to discuss something about the indefinite articles AN and A. So generally, AN is used with a word that begins with a vowel sound. Okay, so as you all know, since the first standard, we are all studying what are vowels. Okay. So, yeah, Prema has posted and they help us to find out whether the noun we refer to is specific or not. Yeah, that is for definite article the. Okay, the helps us to find out whether the noun we refer to is specific or not. Whether spelling is W-H-E-T-H-E-R. Okay, there are two weathers, Prema. What, okay. you, type, hmm, what you type this uh, climate? Okay. Weather, rain, sun, sunny, rainy, that weather. Okay, ma'am. But here you can use W-H-E-T-H here. Yeah, fine. Okay, so A is generally used, sorry, AN is generally used with a word that begins with a vowel sound. So what are the five vowels? Aradhana, can you tell the vowels? Ma'am, A-E-I-O-U. Yes, yeah, A-E-I-O and U. Okay, so AN is used with words that begin with a vowel sound okay so here they are telling vowel sound and not vowel alphabet there is one reason for that okay instead of telling vowel alphabet they are telling it vowel sound in the next slide you will understand the reason similarly a is used with a word that begins with a consonant sound so what are consonants aradhana Yes, uh, Prema, can you tell what are consonants? Yes, ma'am. B, C, D, F, yeah. E, H, J, K, L, M, M, N, P, Q, R, S, T, 
B W X Y Z. Exactly. So there are twenty six alphabets in English, and if we just subtract the vowels, if we just take away the five vowels out of twenty six, then twenty six minus five twenty one. Twenty one. Twenty one. So there are totally twenty one consonants. So A is used with a word that begins with a consonant sound. Okay. So an is used with a word that begins with a vowel sound, and a is used with a word that begins with a consonant sound. Next, an is used with common singular and countable nouns. Okay. So generally, an, a. What are the meanings of these words? They actually have a meaning also. If I tell an apple, it means one apple. If I tell a mango, it means one mango. I have an apple in my hand. It means I have one apple in my hand. If I tell uh, my brother is having a mango, okay, Lord uh, Muruga and Lord Ganesha had a rivalry between them for a mango. Okay, how many of you know this story? How many of you know the story? Yes, Murugan and uh, Pulayar had a rival. They had a clash between them for just one mango, a mango. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so I hope you all know that story. Okay. So A means generally one. An also means one. Okay. So they can be used with common nouns, singular nouns, and countable nouns. Common nouns. We all know what are common nouns. Names of uh, places. That is um. in general like city town country then we can tell fruits vegetables girls boys man woman these are all common nouns singular you all know what is singular countable means those that can be counted so examples for an an apple an ice cream parlor an overcoat so here you can see the three words apple ice cream and overcoat apple begins with vowel sound a ice cream begins with the vowel sound i overcoat begins with the vowel sound o similarly for a you can see a mango so m is a vowel sound then grocery g is a sorry consonant sound m is a consonant sound g is again a consonant s is again a consonant so a mango a grocery shop a shirt so this is how you have to use an and a so most of most of us are familiar with this part of using the indefinite articles but there are certain exceptions in using a and an okay so i want um, ananda krishnan can you read that uh, box in the left side only that definition alone um if a word begins with a vowel vowel sound but with the consonant letter we use the article an yeah examples Yeah, an MBA yeah. student. Yes. Uh, an MBA student. An MLA from Tamil Nadu. An hmm. MP from Kerala. An LPG cylinder. Yeah, very good. So thank you. So here you can see there is one exception while using the articles a and an. So first I am talking about an. Okay. So generally in the first example we saw all the three words apple, ice cream, overcoat. All the three words were beginning with vowels. Okay, A is a vowel, I is a vowel, O is also a vowel. But here you can see, M is a consonant. Again, M M or M is consonant. L is also a consonant. But still, why are we using an MBA, an MLA, an MP, and an LPG? This so, yes, the sound of A E I O O vowel sound, ma'am. Yes, because we're telling M L A. If I'm telling M M, so A A that that sound is coming right? M L A, M P, then uh, L P G, L P G gas. Okay, so L P G, M P, member of parliament, M P. So here the sound is becoming M A M. Okay, so that's the reason we are using the article an instead of. A. Most of the people do this mistake mm -hmm. even in competitive examination, even in examinations like uh, TNPSC or Kerala PSC or uh, all the public ex government examinations. Many people are committing this mistake. So you students, please be aware of that. Okay. So now again coming to A. 
we generally use a with words that begin with a consonant that is a mango a grocery shop a shirt so m g s these words all all these letters are consonants right m is a consonant g is a consonant s is also a consonant but here you can see kiran are you there in the meet can you just read the box right box if a word begins with an consonant sound Mm. but with a vowel alphabet that we use the article a examples one a one man show a one eyed man a university or a uniform a european thank you so here you can see Welcome. one man show one eyed man university european so here you can see the words are beginning with vowels o u and e okay but you are using the article a you are not telling an one man show an one eyed man an european an university that's wrong you have to tell a one man show a one eyed man the reason is while telling one you are using the the sound that comes from your throat that the the voice that comes from your mouth is one wa one man show so you are telling one right this try telling one one you can you can know that one so you are telling wa so wa is a consonant in tamil in malayalam wa is a consonant so that's why you are telling a one man show a one eyed man okay oru kannu irukirathu okay a one eyed man a university you are not telling university it's not university it's university so you are using the sound ya ya okay you are using the sound of y university u okay the next is you can see a european you are not telling european you are telling european so a european okay that's how you have to identify the indefinite articles while writing with a word or in a sentence okay also we will discuss this one and in the next class we will be discussing d definite article so today the last slide is words beginning with h this is also an exception in english language yes who is ready to read this slide um i will read ma'am uh, uh, me yes yes kavier san yes do h is consonant in words like har honor and honest the letter h is silent so we use the article an before these words I was writing in the park for an hour. She received the award with an honor. Raghu is an honest gentleman. Yes. So here you can see some words that begin with H like har, honor and honest. H is silent. Okay. So we will not tell hover. It is hour. It's not honor. It's honor. It's not honest. It's honest. So in these words, H is considered to be silent. so if h is taken then the first letter will be o right so be, being o is a vowel so you can use the article an so an hour an honor an honest okay so this is all about the indefinite articles a and an so in the next class we will be learning what is the word to use the okay and what are the situations we are using the definite article then word to not use any article and we will also do some practice questions okay guys so i think we can wind up today's session so are you all happy with today's class yes ma'am yes ma'am yes, ma yes, ma yes, ma yes, ma newcomers newcomers